Morning, Carol. Morning, Sally and John. Morning to you too. Yes, indeed, we have Storm Kieron coming our way on Wednesday night and Thursday, bringing some damaging winds. Indeed, we could have as much as 70 to 90 mile an hour gusts with exposure in some parts of the south, particularly through the English Channel. And we're looking at widespread heavy rain on areas where the ground is already saturated. Now, the Met Office has an amber weather warning out for parts of Northern Ireland this morning. It expires at nine o'clock. But if we follow that round, you can see we've also got rain across Northern England, Lincolnshire, Yorkshire, down into East Anglia. The best of the weather today in the sense that it's going to be the sunniest with the fewest showers will be across Scotland. For Northern Ireland, for Northern England and eastern parts of England, where we've got that weak weather front, you'll find it will hang on to a bit of cloud. The rain will turn more patchy and drizzly, but behind it, we're back into sunshine and showers. Until later, when the next band of rain starts to show its hand, coming in from the southwest with strengthening winds. Temperatures today, well, nothing to particularly write home about. We're looking at a range with the top temperature up to about 13, maybe 14 or 15 in the far south. So through this evening and overnight, this rain continues to advance steadily northwards. There'll be an early frost across the highlands, but the temperatures will actually rise as the cloud builds and then we'll see the rain continue to move northwards. Tomorrow, that rain will continue its journey northwards, preceded by some snow for a time on the hills. Behind it, we're back into sunshine and showers. And then later in the day, we see the first signs of Storm Chiron coming our way, bringing the heavy rain and the damaging winds. Sal and John. OK, Carol, for now, thank you very much indeed.